What's happening, everybody? Jay Shockblast here, and uh, take a look. A little bit of Lego Batman 2 action, because uh, after a prolonged absence, I am ready to uh, talk about some Lego Batman 3. Uh, this one, of course, uh, Lego Batman 3 is called Beyond Gotham, and uh, I'm pretty excited about it. Uh, it's coming out um, on... Ugh, I hate flying with these guys. Um, it is coming out J November 11th uh, in North America, and I believe the 14th out in Europe. And uh, I'm pretty stoked about it. So there's, they've started announcing a lot of characters, and uh, I'm not going to sit there and go through the whole list of everybody that they've announced. But, uh, you know, one of the, the groups of characters that I've always been a fan of is the Green Lantern. Or, I'm sorry, the Lanterns in general. I, I do like Green Lantern, uh, Hal Jordan. Uh, definitely a fan. So uh, I am absolutely looking forward to seeing how the Lanterns are involved with LEGO Batman 3 Beyond Gotham. Uh, so right now I'm playing with Hal Jordan and Sinestro. Uh, Sinestro, obviously the Yellow Lantern. Hal Jordan, the Green Lantern. And uh, both of those guys are going to be in uh, LEGO Batman 3. And, uh, you know, obviously, you know, Sinestro is just Sinestro. For whatever reason, uh, they're just, I mean, I, I understand it. They want to have somebody called Green Lantern. So Hal Jordan is simply called Green Lantern. Um, there are a few Green Lanterns already announced. Uh, there's Kilowog and Jon Stewart. Um, and both of them are just go kind of going by their names, uh, which is fine. That makes a lot of sense, to be honest with you. Um, one thing that's a little bit different... Uh, well, actually, I, don't, I want to say it a little bit different. Um, you know, one thing that they've already done is they have already announced um, basically a representative from just about every Lantern Corps. And uh, I say that because there are two that are technically missing, and I'll get into that in just a moment. So the Lanterns that have been announced so far, uh, for the Yellow Lanterns, of course, you have Sinestro, who uh, I'm playing as right now. And... Um, and then you also have uh, Arkillo, uh, who obviously makes a lot of sense. Um, he, he basically kind of... Flying in this game was it makes me appreciate LEGO Marvel. Um, so, you know, you've got Arkillo, and uh, you also have, um, you know, Sinestro. So those are our, our lanterns, uh, our yellow lanterns, I should say. And uh, then for... Um, for Red Lanterns, we have Atrocitus and Bleez, uh, which is fantastic. I'm a big uh, Red Lantern fan, uh, so it's definitely awesome that um, you know they've got you know two already represented. Um, I'll get into who I'd like to see that's missing in just a moment. Um, for the Indigos, uh, Indigo Tribe, uh, they have Indigo One, which, to be completely honest with you, uh, is all you really need. Uh, from them, that's really the only one that makes a little bit of sense. Um, and then from uh, obviously, there's only one orange lantern, Larflees. Uh, so Larflees has been announced, and uh, then you have Saint Walker from the Blue Lanterns, and uh, finally you have uh, the Star Sapphire, uh, Carol Ferris. Uh, so for Carol Ferris, they're literally just calling her Star Sapphire, uh, which they generally do in the comics as well. So. That kind of makes a lot of sense. Um, so, you know, definitely a great list. Uh, the main lanterns for each of the, the colors uh, spectrums are, are there. So that's obviously perfect. Um, no white lantern, no black lantern. So in my opinion, since they're going to have 150 characters, you know, why not go ahead and have, um, you know, either Necron or Black Hand uh, be there as a black lantern. And uh, why not go ahead and have, um, you know, Kyle Rayner. Uh, Kyle Rayner can be the White Lantern. Um, and, you know, I'll, I'll get into the other reasoning behind my, uh, my belief there uh, in just a moment, why I think Kyle Rayner makes a lot of sense to add to the game. Um, you know, those are all really, you know, great characters to add. You know, I'd also love to see them get Guy Gardner in there. And, uh, you know, honestly, I wouldn't mind seeing Fatality. Uh, just because she was a Yellow Lantern and a, a Star Sapphire. So, I mean, what do those characters all have in common? Guy Gardner, Kyle Rayner, and Fatality. 
you can give them multiple rings. Um, you know, Guy Gardner uh, right now is a Red Lantern, uh, so you can give him a Red Lantern ring, and he can be a Green Lantern. Um, with, uh, you know, Guy Gardner, Guy Gardner has worn all of the rings, so he can basically be any of the Lanterns. Um, and then you have, you know, Necron and Black Hand, so you can have some Black Lanterns. And uh, Fatality, like I said, she's been a, a Star Sapphire, and she's been a Yellow Lantern. So uh, that would be pretty awesome if you get those characters in the game. My overall point with the Lanterns, though, is um, I would love to see any character in this game able to be a Lantern. Uh, you know, anybody is able to put on a Power Ring. So, you know, there's a couple characters that have already been announced. Uh, you know, Barry Allen, Flash, uh, Wonder Woman, um, Supergirl, Batman, Lex Luthor, The Atom. All those characters have been, you know, announced so far, and all of them have worn lantern rings. Uh, then, of course, there's also Mera, uh, which since there's Aquaman, I don't see why you wouldn't have Mera. Um, she's also worn the red lantern ring. You know, John Stewart has been an Indigo Lantern. Uh, we've already got him as a Green Lantern. Or Indigo Tribe, I guess is what they're called. Um, so it would make a lot of sense if they had him be able to wear that ring. You know, Lex was an Orange Lantern. You know, Batman was a Yellow Lantern and a Black Lantern. Uh, Supergirl, like I said, is a Red Lantern right now. You know, Wonder Woman was part of the Star Sapphires. Um, and then Barry Allen and Kyle Rayner were, were Blue Lanterns. Um, you know, Kyle Rayner was a Blue Lantern for a little while, so, you know, obviously, uh, you know, Hal Jordan has been a Yellow Lantern, uh, he's been a Black Lantern, he's been a White Lantern, you know, Sinestro has been a Green Lantern, the White Lantern, so, like, all these guys have, have had multiple rings, so why not let anybody put on a ring? Why not be able to have, you know, one of the great things about this game, on top of having so many characters, is there's, there's going to be a lot of, um, you know, suits and stuff. So, you know, why wouldn't you want Batman to have a yellow lantern suit and a green lantern? I'm, I'm sorry, not green lantern, a, a yellow and a black lantern suit. You know, that just makes sense, if you ask me. Um, so, you know, let them have those rings. Just give anybody a ring. If you want to put a ring on Superman, make him a green lantern, you know, go for it. What, what really does it mean? You just basically put their head on top of a, uh, you know, a lantern suit. You don't have to go crazy with it. I mean, maybe give, you know, Superman a Green Lantern cape. Uh, that would be kind of awesome. Um, but, you know, a lot of those characters really just make a lot of sense. Um, and just letting, by letting anybody wear any lantern ring, you're kind of giving just a lot of extra flavor to the game. So that's really what I'd love to see. Let any land, let any character wear a power ring, you know, one of the colors, whichever color you want. Um, you know, we've already seen Lex in his suit, so having him be an orange lantern, I can't imagine that would take all that much more effort. Um, it would just be really awesome, I think. You know, you don't have to go too crazy, you know, with, like, you know, Supergirl being a, a red lantern. You know, there's a little bit of a distinctive look to her. Um... Same thing with Guy Gardner, you know, he's kind of growing a beard now, look a little edgier. Um, I, I really feel like those would be some really great opportunities. You know, Catwoman as uh, an orange lantern, you know, for Avarice. Um, you know, uh, Hawkman, I think he was a black lantern and a white lantern at one point. So I'm not even counting anybody that was a, a black lantern. Because, you know, Aquaman was a black lantern. You know, a lot of guys were lanterns. Um, you know, dead lanterns or or even White Lanterns, like, you know, Martian Manhunter um, was a Black Lantern, I think he was a White Lantern too. Um, you know, Swamp Thing was the White Lantern. Um, so, I would love to see them take full advantage of having Lantern, you know, power rings. Um, you know, we already know that you're going to be playing the game on Oa. Um, so, I mean, you know, there's that. Uh, there's just a really a lot of opportunity. Uh, to, to really add some nice flavor to the game uh, by having the lanterns. And, uh, you know, you already have a bunch of them announced, you know, so uh, why not, you know, go a couple couple more. Um, you know, it would just, it just, to me, it seems like it would be a lot of fun, you know. Um, 
having the the power rings you know putting a power ring on all these characters you know gives them the opportunity to fly uh, which they wouldn't otherwise have um, for some of the characters anyway so uh, what do you guys think do you guys want to see more lanterns um, you know more of the different characters able to wear lantern rings because you know that's really again not counting them against the 150 characters too you know just basically giving all these characters extra suits they can wear you know by making them lanterns um i think it'd be a great idea um i'm interested to hear what you guys have to say uh, a lot of people have been asking me in a bunch of my videos if i'm going to be playing lego batman 3 uh beyond gotham and the answer is unequivocally yes. I know who my crowd is. I know who got me where I am. And you guys put me where I am and have allowed me the opportunities that I've had uh, because I enjoy playing Lego games. And let's let's be honest, that's why so many of you have found me is Lego games. And uh, I can't wait to play even more Lego games. Um, one interesting thing that I read before I let you guys go, um, I heard there's going to be a Jurassic Park Lego game. So I'd like to know what you guys think about that uh, for the Jurassic World movie. And, um, yeah, what do you guys think? You want to see more lanterns? Because I certainly do. Uh, I think all those characters would uh, would be great. I would love to see, you know, especially Necron. Um, but Black Hand would make a lot of sense, too. Um, there's a lot of characters that haven't been announced that, you know, I have no doubt are going to be announced at some point soon. So definitely stay tuned for that. And, uh you know, uh, I wanted to talk about a little bit of Lego uh, Batman, so here we go. Uh, I was a little sad that it wasn't at PAX Prime, uh, but I did play um, Disney Infinity 2.0 uh, Mar Marvel Super Heroes, so that was a lot of fun. But uh, yeah, man, Green Lantern, Yellow Lantern, Orange Lantern, all of those guys. Uh, we were going to see them in Lego Batman 3. Hope you guys enjoyed, and we shall catch you later. Let me know what you guys think about my uh, little little opinion here. I uh, hope you guys have a good one. See ya.